Oh. Hey, welcome to Beer 30. I'm Greg. With me is Josh and Josh. Hey, guys. Hi, hey, Greg. Hi, Greg. So, today, you brought a beer for us. Yep. What, what, what'd you bring? Because I, I don't know. I... <laughs> The name I, of, I can't. You I can don't barely know how to pronounce this you, well, thing. and you can barely read it. It's written in sure. such a like calligraphical. Okay. I don't know. M L A with okay, an I'll, apostrophe. I'll actually put it on the screen here, and you, everyone else can uh, figure out what M L A D E K. Mel- Is that what it melodic. D E K. Melodic D. Yeah, I guess so. Well, there's a accent mark over yeah. the A, or is that a U? There's a little. I think it's an A. So anyway, this is from a collaboration between Se- Second Shift Brewing and Perennial, both St. Louis yep. breweries. Um, do we know about this? No, what I just actually grabbed it, is? it out of the fridge and brought it. Oh, you, di- you didn't even uh, look at what kind of beer There's nothing this is. on the damn label. There's nothing on the label <laughs> that says what it is. Wow. Yeah, you're right. Uh, for a good time, call 314-325-GATO, okay, huh. and it says 9.1% alcohol per volume. Oh, so it must be an Imperial. Let's see. Okay. So, with a purple can like this, you don't normally think stout. Yeah. So, um... Pronounced melodic. M-E-L-O-D-I-C. It's, that's how it's pronounced. In- interesting. Imperial well, stout. Spell it that way. Here, let's... Yeah. Okay. Oh, w- oh, yep, you're right. Delicious it's going to be a stout. <laughs> Blended with cinnamon and vanilla. Oh, interesting. 9.1% ABV, dark brown in color, and limited availability. We got this at the beer shop on Main Street. Oh, oh yeah? Yeah. They have a really, a pretty fancy website. Second shift? Yeah. Okay. Um, go for it. Grab your, <laughs> grab your beers. It smells so, good. What it is it? Cinnamony. Can you? Uh, does, that's wow. all it says about it. That's all it, it says. Ooh, yeah. That's all I taste. Cinnamon and chocolate. A little vanilla aroma. Similar Ooh. to yeah. Abraxas. Yeah. It's got a very high cinnamon, like yeah. yeah. I I told you guys that Abraxas this year was like super cinnamony compared really? to really. I haven't had it this year. Batches. So I wonder if uh. so. I don't like cinnamon much, and I definitely don't like it when it's strong. You like beer. cinnamon? I don't. I don't I, care. I mean, cinnamon toast crunch. I, that's that's not that, real cinnamon. It's, it's, what do you it's mean they little, use real cinnamon? I said it's, it's a little not more real cinnamon. Oh, it's, it's a little more subtle, chemical. I think. Oh, I agree. This mm. is punch this you is in your them. mouth. Yeah, I agree. <clears throat> so melodic, you would think, is something that's very Third. mild. Yeah. Melodic music, you I, know. Melodic to me, it gives you that impression with the with the can, the, the can. design on the can too. To me, though, melodic means kind of everything's in harmony, and I can't say that one. Yes, the cinnamon is strong, but I think everything goes together. The vanilla and the chocolate both are very middle of the road, <laughs> okay. along with the cinnamon. Like going together, like in harmony, like right peanut there. butter and jelly. Yeah, there you the go. The perfect melody, like peas and carrots. The perfect melody, like now, this show. Yeah, sure. When we're all here. Right. When we're all here, um, you know, we have... we Usually yeah. we all switch personalities at time to time, right? It's not bad. For me, I think the cinnamon is just too strong, and I don't even notice the chocolate and vanilla. Well, I get a lot of chocolate. Really? I don't get any, hardly any vanilla. And it just... I got a real strong, like, alcohol. That's what I was going to say. It's afterwards. really boozy to me. Yeah. yeah. I get dark chocolate and cinnamon. That's yeah. what I get. Hmm. And I can't say that it's... A bad flavor. Um, it is spicier than normal, yeah. you know. Yeah. But um, hmm. for me, it's not too bad. But uh, collaborations like this, boy, what, they're hit or miss. You, how do you think? How do you think that comes about? Like they call each other, but do yeah. they? Uh, I guess we. I mean, we we could probably ask Denny about this, but yeah. if. If there's a collaboration between two beer companies, does one just say, hey, I have this stout um, that I just, you know, I have, this is our perennial stout. I was wondering if you guys at Second Shift can 
do a little twist on it or whatever? Or do they just get together and go, hey, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's invite Denny on the show and see if he can come next week, and we'll ask him these questions. There you go. I probably need to clean all the water out of my basement before I want We can do it in my basement. Oh, that's a great idea. Yeah. We can take this show on the road. Show on the with road with guests, or even see if he'd be willing to let us. We'd have to record it at at his place. Oh, I don't think <clears> he'd have a problem. I don't think he would either. But the question would be: Do you have the ability to record and post yeah, later? Do it from behind a the phone. Scene. This is behind the scenes. Yeah. Though. Well, I can take here. my new camera. Yeah. There you go. I don't know. How Whoa. I don't know if it would record. Look at all these ideas just yeah. flowing today. I don't know if it would record. Just like the water in the basement. Just like the water in the basement. Ideas are flowing. <laughs> So I think I'm having a problem wow. with that. That was rude. Yeah. He's kind rude. Of, kind he come, misses two weeks like an <laughs> asshole and, and comes in throwing, oh. throwing shade. <laughs> He's the one that brought it up. He wow. So the beer, melodic. <laughs> yeah. It was great until Josh ruined the atmosphere. Oh. Yeah. So there's you actually an accent mark so what, over that A. What you don't know is we're standing in knee-deep water. <laughs> It's not knee deep. It's like not the, e- we had to move hey. the extension cords up. <laughs> it's <laughs> just a little puddle. It looked like the airport in Dallas. <laughs> yeah, did you see that? Wow. God, so could God. you imagine coming home from vacation with that? Yeah, so that guys, uh, uh, sticking back to the subject at hand is our beer <laughs> that we have. Uh, what do you think of this? What's your What's your rating? You guys don't seem that you're too fond of it. I'd say it's a B plus. I was gonna say B minus. Too much cinnamon for me. It. Th- there is a lot of cinnamon. I, yeah, I, I agree. B, B, B plus. It's, it's a good, it's a good stout, a good beer. But it's just, for me, it's just that's, not, yeah, uh, too much, too much, enough already. Okay, <laughs> well, we much. get it. It's cinnamon. It's too you know? much. All right, let's. I'll, uh, I'll message Denny right now. Okay. Oh, so I'm anyway, check out our other videos on uh, YouTube. Go to Beer Thirty. T- check out Beer 30 TV or go to our website beer30.tv. That is it. We will see you next time for another episode of Beer 30. See ya.